First at 5.30, disturbing new details in a story Eyewitness News first reported last month. More dogs have been sickened by a mysterious illness. And some believe the dogs have been poisoned. And tonight, we've learned more about how they died. Eyewitness News reporter Nick Nuosu has the latest developments from East Providence. Well, in just the last few weeks, the Rhode Island SPCA says it has received even more reports of dogs in the same neighborhood in Warwick being struck by the same illness, some of those dogs even dying. Eyewitness News first reported a few weeks ago something strange was happening in the Governor Francis Farms neighborhood in Warwick. Six dogs sickened, and now there could be more. When, the, when you initially interviewed us, we had six confirmed cases. Once it went public, we, came, we have four more, so right now a total of ten. The SPCA believes the dogs were sick in between 2004 and as recently as this summer. Symptoms include vomiting and paralysis from their hind end. Police and the SPCA say the dogs could have been poisoned, and there is a person of interest. All ten uh, victims have either had some direct confrontation, um, walk by a particular residence, uh, and, and we do have, we would call at this point, a person of interest, but uh, we haven't charged anyone as of yet. The individual allegedly wrote letters to some of the dog owners, the contents of the letters threatening in regards to the health and safety of their animals. However, most of the evidence is circumstantial, creating a challenging case. Unless we have the animal to sample, to get blood tests, tissue samples from, Medically, it makes it very difficult. And if you're concerned about your animal or if you have any information about this case, you are asked to contact the Rhode Island SPCA or Warwick Police. With the Mobile Newsroom, I'm Nika Nwosu, Eyewitness News.